Hello everyone. I hope you are doing well. So today I'm going to talk about connecting to a remote server or a remote machine because sometimes you want to connect to a machine which is somewhere else and you don't know how to do it. So I will be doing it. I will take an example here with our project because we we are doing some projects here on ALX and we are using a remote machine which is a sandbox in Ubuntu for sandbox so I will be showing you how to connect to it remotely first of all you need to 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 go to that sandbox you need to click here to 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 your to, to this bar sidebar then you you have your down arrows you know and then you click to this one sandboxes after clicking to sandboxes in our code you need to go down to your to to ubuntu 20 if this ubuntu 20 is not run it will be like others like this you can click to run but i all i already clicked to run then i have this so to connect to a remote server in your local machine instead of clicking to web term which will open in the browser we will click to this ssh to copy the command then after clicking to that we can come and open git bash right click open git bash so to be able to use this git bash you need to be able to to be able to use this you need to make sure that github is installed in your machine and that you have installed or you have selected git bash as a command line to to be installed so the command we copied we can come here and paste it so you see ssh this is the host we are connecting to so if you click enter the machine will search for the connection then it will ask for the password as you know we have the password here you can copy the password and come again here and pass the password and we are good to go so because it's a password you you cannot see the password but trust the computer it's already there and you can click enter and wait a little bit and you are inside your your remote machine if i click ls i can see all my folders which i am working with inside my remote machine so that that's that's how you connect to your remote machine but also you can do whatever you want in this machine and uh, yeah that's it actually so if you have some questions or if you have you want me to like clarify other things or you have a topic that you want me to talk about write it in the comment don't forget to subscribe and like and share the video so that other people can know how to connect because this is a useful uh technique because sometimes people are having issues to copy and paste inside the sandbox when they connect to the web but here you can copy and paste you know and you can do whatever you want so thank you so much i don't want this video to be so long and yeah goodbye